A South Island church is doing its part to bring islanders together at a most basic level. We're pleased to have Rachel Ward, the coordinator of a program called Providence on Wednesday at the Providence Church. Rachel, welcome to WHHI. Thank you. Good morning. Tell us a little bit about how your program is helping teach English to our Hispanic community. Absolutely. So down the street from Providence is a um, apartment complex mm -hmm. where a number of Hispanic people live. And so we wondered how we could best serve them. St. Luke's Church already had NOC's after school program for tutoring children. So we went to Dr. Sharma NOC and said, what do their parents need? And he said, community support and English as a second language classes. So we um, added to our traditional Wednesday night program um, as English as a second language class and we flyered the apartment building and waited to see how many would come. And how many came? Um, the first week we had about 25 uh, people from Cordillo Courts. Okay. And we, about, we average about 20 or 15 every week. And the entire program, our Providence on Wednesday program, which has dinner and extra classes for mm -hmm. English speaking people as well, marriage and parenting. We have anywhere from 85 to 125 every week. This is just terrific. Yeah. Uh, you, you've, so you've reached out, they're reaching back and Absolutely. something special is starting to happen here. How important is it to, to be teaching, how, you know, how appreciative are these folks of the opportunity to learn English living on our island? Well, you know, it's just been a wonderful experience yeah. for them as well as us because we've um, met their children mm -hmm. and they've actually just recently completed a level of the curriculum and it's called the A1 level. So they can actually take that to employers and it will help them get employment. We've met people that have been on the island for seven to 15 years who are not fluent in English. Mm -hmm. And so they're very grateful for this opportunity. But what's really wonderful for us is it's revitalized our Wednesday night program and this group of people have formed a community amongst themselves uh, as well so within Cordillo Court, Court's apartments they're making change there as well. I've got to imagine that this is just going to grow and grow and grow. I mean the, the opportunity here is, is huge isn't it? Yes it is absolutely huge and actually this group that just graduated mm -hmm. um, our Providence on Wednesday program kind of officially ends in the spring. Okay. They love it so much, they asked if they could keep coming on Wednesday night to class. And uh, we're actually going to have worship services in the summer on Wednesday nights for people who are out on the beach and for our ESL population. So they've actually um, made our program better. That's terrific. Good stuff. Uh, what else? What, what's next uh, now that you've got the flame lit? Absolutely. So some of the needs that we saw were in, when the, the time changed in the fall and it got mm -hmm. colder and darker, it was harder for them to walk down to our uh, church. So we started a free bus service. So now we have free dinner, free bus service, and free childcare for everyone that comes. It's free for anyone. Um, and actually what's interesting is that there's a donation basket if you'd like to give and every week we've made more money from donations than it actually cost us to do the program. Um, so it's very, very cost effective. I actually laughed with the two guys who do, the, they actually cook the dinner every week. I said, you have the most successful restaurant on Hilton. <laughs> <laughs> so um, we are going to add an all day vacation Bible school that okay. will involve kids on the whole island, but also the children of the people who live at Cordillo Courts. And that's gonna be in the last week in June. And then we will have the Providence on Wednesday worship services in the summer. Well, amen to all the work you're doing. Yeah. For folks who wanna find out more about being a part of this on either side of it, uh, what, what can they do? Um, of course you can call the church but much more easily you can look at www.causegodjoy.com is our website and then on Facebook you can look at Providence Hilton Head or Cause God Joy. Fantastic stuff. Thank you so much Rachel. Rachel Thank you. Ward of Providence Church.